Hi everybody, it's Sally with Vintage Discoveries with a vintage jewelry bag haul unbagging. Gonna dump it all out like that. <laughs> uh, it's a big heavy bangle with blue rhinestones. It's almost like, I think, I think you can buy like that sticky rhinestone stuff, right? Because there's some that are popping off. Ooh, I like these. These kind of um, big door knockers. Is it supposed to not lay flat? I like these. And they're pierced. I will definitely wear that if we have another one in here. And we do. Oh, it's a little bent. I'm always hesitant to bend it back because you're going to snap it. But it didn't snap. I like them. Need a little touch up. You have to have those bigger backs. I don't think these are going to work. But I like them. Oh, these are pretty. Very snappy. Very nice. With the kind of, what do you call that? The colors go from light to dark or dark to light, like ombre. They're pretty, not marked with anything though. Little silver ring. That's cute. Maybe you can get it like initial or something on there. Oh, cute little rose. This is missing whatever was in there. Good to craft with. You could stick whatever you want on it. I thought it was a cat at first, and I don't know if there's another one. Clip on Aurora Borealis bead. Isn't that earrings? Oh, pumpkin. I love pumpkins, sparkly pumpkins. A hoop. It's tangled. What in the heck? This is an alpaca, Mexico heart with mother pearl and abalone. Oh, it's not, it doesn't belong to this. <laughs> like, why would it be on there? It's so weird. Get off. Well, it wants to be there, apparently. All right, so it doesn't belong on there, but this is from Japan. And actually, would somebody wear that? It's like a music box. Ooh. It's all rusted. Played some kind of music in there. That's weird. I wonder if that could be fixed. It was overwound or something. These are pretty. Love me some glass beads. I don't think it... Where's the clasp? Oh, here it is. A barrel clasp. I like that. Kind of pantherish, right? Not bad. Pretty, pretty stones in this. Good for crafting. They are pretty Aurora Borealis. A stiff watch. Oh, 
It's a Loris Mickey watch with big red numbers. It feels like it weighs like nothing. I have a few of these, not this one though. Whoop, with his finger pointing. Let's see. It is Walt Disney Company. It's in bad shape though. I think it's all plastic. Somebody might like it. Oh, this looks kind of like lapis beads. Also good for crafting. I think this is supposed to look like um, cinnabar, but I don't believe it is. I'm not a pro on it, but I don't believe it is. This reminds me of something like Kate Spade, but fake. Oh, Sonoma. Big plastic stretchy beads. Like, ugh, I don't like these necklaces. Like they're just, I don't want to use the word ugly. It was Macy's. 36 bucks. Not intended for children 12 and under. I don't think it's intended for adults either. I mean, I guess you could craft with it. I remember when this was in style, this kind of thing here. Not bad looking, I guess. Right? If you like that snaky look. And this. It's a look, right? Not my look, but it could be somebody else's look, right? Right. These are cute. I have a pair like this, smaller. I think they have a back a black background. I know the name of it. All I can think of is Cloisonne, and that's not it. Shamil, Shamazel. Can't remember it. I'll think of it. Guilloche enamel. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, nice. Piece of tiger's eye with an allure borealis. Looks homemade. It's a nice piece of stone. Ooh. Phantom of the Opera. Can't think of any of the songs. I've seen it on Broadway twice. I can't think of anything. Mm. Lucky you, I can't think of any of the songs. Ooh, this is pretty. Ooh, ooh. Ah. This. These can be harvested and used. They're very pretty. And this is pretty too. I don't know if I have the other one. Which way does it go? Like this. Let's put them to the side and we shall see. Oh, a little kitty. A little kitty. A little kitty playing with a ball. Looks like silver, but I don't see any marking. Somebody made this. It was cute. I like the kitty. That's about it. These look like Sarah. Mm, no, nope, I don't think so. Normally I don't see that kind of back on Sarah, but they do have a similar leaf design and silver. But these are pretty. I like the backs too. Uh oh, what is this? Abacus. This is like a ooh, mm -mm. 
No. Who sells this stuff? Who wears this stuff? It's another art teacher edition of fashion. Nothing against art teachers. I'm just reminds me of something an art teacher I had would wear. Interesting things. That's all I'm saying. So, yeah, this is it. Reminds me of school for some reason. Didn't we like climb on these kind of things? You know, bigger, but yeah, that's weird. It's attached to this weird thing. But, you know, if somebody likes it, wear it. Like Doug says from his channel. Which ex escapes me, of course. You know, everything escapes me. Ow. But this is some beads you could probably eat, reuse. Somebody could. Somebody tried to make something. These are class. Okay, so is this the same one? And I just regurgitated back into the pile here. No. I got two. I got two. And they're pretty. Oops. Little moon glow beads this looks like bigger than a bracelet like an anklet another one of these so i got a pair on that classic pearl this Kind of wooden, I would say. Weird. Blue. Let's see. Um, tail of sky of shy. Tail of sky. Bet you I don't have another one anyway. Have another one of these. Another Aurora Borealis one. They're all around the same kind of color, Aurora Borealis. This one. This homemade kind of one. Cute little apple. This is Monet. Nope, it's Shafari. That's cute. Cute apple. Pretty sparkly heart. These are nice. No name, but to, oh, wait a minute. Pierced with the... Have you seen that before? I don't know why I've never seen that. But I like them. Kind of a bluish purple. Um, and the rhinestones at the bottom. They're pretty. Very light, too. Got this one. It kind of goes up the ear. I'm not sure if there is another. Not seeing it. So those could be harvested if you need to use them. This is pretty. 
definitely. Oh, and I don't see another one of this green one. Oh. Unfortunately. Because I really like it. But somebody could use those stones for replacements. Look at this. That's a pretty one. I like the bottom, how they have it. Like a little cones almost. Oh, I don't see another one of those either. These are cute. I can get them unhooked without breaking them. I hope. Yay. These are cute. It's got a little painted enamel that came off. And these acrylic flowers. They're very cute. I like them. Moon glow. Very dirty. I hope it's not like that permanently. No, it's just, it's just dirty. I have one like this in light pink. It's for sale on my Etsy. No, eBay, I'm sorry. And this one will clean up nicely. These are so comfortable. I love the moon glow. This is a pretty raspberry. So that's nice. Um, you know, if you like purple. Swirly, thick um, acrylic. Oh, no, I don't like this. But somebody can do something with it. And this big chunky thing. This is something I couldn't wear unless I had it like sitting over a shirt. I wouldn't wear it anyway. It's not my style, but. This touching my skin would bother me because it's hefty, really hefty. But that's the last thing in there. I think, oh, there's this. Let's see, probably Japan. Yep, Japan. Some pearlies. And I think that was it. Yep, that was it. So that wasn't bad for our bag. Um, I love the moon glow and some a couple of other earrings were cool and the rest is going to go into a craft lot. So what was else I was going to show? Oh, I think somebody asked to see flowers or they wanted to buy like flower pins. I have a lot of them. Um, you know, we have your typical this painted metal which I love and I have these kind which I don't know what you would explain them as just plain old metal it's kind of not painted to me it's maybe it is painted metal big and fun I was gonna say that's my was my nickname in high school but it wasn't <laughs> just kidding See, this one is really tall. And this is just acrylic plastic. Comes right out there. That's cool. These I've found a few. Some of them have like an iridescence to them. They're older. This one's just plain old gold, gold, and gold. this such a pretty mauve remember when mauve was all the rage this is heavy you would have to put this on a coat because it's kind of heavy metal it's old but it's in good shape look at the paint look how nice 
mauve good old mauve then we have this one <laughs> enamel very pretty love the colors i don't know if you'd consider this a flower would you it's almost like a poinsettia poinsettia but i like the shape of course this one, so pretty. I have tons more flowers. Where are they at? I'll have to keep looking. But yeah, I really do like the flowers. And I have so many. This one, I think I have two of these actually. Oh, this is a, um, a pendant. How pretty. Just realized that. As you're looking at that, I was looking for my other flowers because I know I have more. But that's it for now. Um, oh, this one. I love this one. So Easter-y. Little enamel flowers and little moon glow Easter eggies. They're so cute. Oh, I have a name. Oh, it's art. Excellent. Love that one. Uh, all right, guys. I'm going to get ready for the sale for tomorrow. I'm going to post it, hopefully. Um, it's hard to give a time. Because last time I had set the time. And it took forever to load. And it was way off base. So, um... I'm going to post it tomorrow. I can't give an exact date because, like I said, the um, the Google or um, YouTube, I should say, is fickle. So, but it will be tomorrow. Hopefully, if the system cooperates, I have a ton of sterling rings, um, bracelets. I grouped some necklaces together: gold, silver, tone. Um, groups of really pretty stuff and um hopefully everybody will like it and i'm gonna number it and uh try to keep track of it but if you have any uh, requests if anything you want to see that i haven't shown um as far as in a sale let me know just email me at vintage.discovery21 at gmail.com Talk to you soon. Thanks, guys. Bye.